happen wherever you go, they play the Friends theme? Yes, everywhere I go. <laughs> Just, you get on the subway and it kicks in. <laughs> is this, because uh, I know a lot's happening in your life right now. You yeah. got this, these smash hit shows, but you're getting married yes. soon. Yes, that's getting in the way with my life. <laughs> <laughs> You just made all the guys here sad. Uh, oh, yeah. <laughs> I made men unhappy. Good. It's my job. <laughs> wow. So it's true. That's what women are put on earth for. What? I thought so. Now, uh, tell me about this wedding. Well, it's coming up. You don't want to say exactly when. It's it... soon. It's soon enough. That's all I know. <laughs> it's, just, it's all too soon. Uh-huh. And this is a, uh, this, this mean, he's a French guy. He's we a can French say guy. That. His entire family is coming from France. Mm-hmm. And his parents don't really speak English <laughs> at all. <laughs> this is a... This is a recipe for disaster. Oh, do, you, do you speak any French at all? A little. I'm learning, but I'll tell you, I have a lot of time for that. So... <laughs> <laughs> There's time to do that. All right. Oh, God. But his mother... The good thing is, his mother loves TV. Loves oh, really? It. Yeah. So she's excited that I'm an actress. And when they came, last time we showed them the TV guide, and like, look, see, that's my show, and that's my picture. And she was like, mm-hmm, oui. Mais Lisa, uh, uh, tu connais some show, Malibu? Like, they have, Malibu? Like Malibu, Santa Barbara. Uh -huh. And all these, they have all these American shows there, and the actors, and she, wants, I, she thinks I know every actor. <laughs> that really? there is, and they all have these names like Lane McGilley, you know, like these like beautiful and insane. Are these, names. these are shows in that they run in France that they, she's yeah. obsessed with. Obsessed. And Does like, she watch your show? Is she complimentary? No. Well, we're not on there, and she doesn't understand it. We showed her a tape. She, she just sat there the whole time, like. <laughs> 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 no, Did yeah. she do this once? Mm. Yeah. Did uh, so you've got in-laws now? That must be weird. Are they? Will, are so you gonna get gifts from these people or? Well, they always bring something. You know, usually they usually bring some soap, <laughs> which I don't. I don't. I don't know. They think it's bad. They don't bathe, but somehow their soap is better. <laughs> I mean, I don't. <laughs> Whoa! Look at that. <laughs> you, you just dismissed a whole culture. <laughs> I can that. do it like that. <laughs> Just like that. Those people don't bathe and they're rude, don't too. Bathe. Uh, so, what? She brings soap? Really? Soap that's a gift? Or cheese. She'll bring a cheese, and Michelle, that's my guy, Michelle. And he gets really excited because this, and it's the smelliest, most god. So it smells like someone vomited in the refrigerator every time you open the door. Awful. And the older it is, the runnier it is, the better. <laughs> Oh, well, they like it that way? They like, they like yeah. the cheese more oh. rancid? Yes. Oh, they, add, they even asked. When I was in France, they asked the waitress, so is this cheese inhabited? Because, <laughs> no, it really, like, it's old enough that things start living in it, and that's supposed to be the measure of the best cheese there is. <laughs> <laughs> I want something living in there. So you can... Something moving across the table. So you send it back if, like, there isn't a fly in it, it goes back. <laughs> They do. I don't. Oh, so you're gonna have to get used to all this. Oh this is God! Very they were odd. like bugs on the floor, and I was like, "Well, <laughs> eat up." I mean, <laughs> <laughs> they must love you. <laughs> How can you they don't not? bathe, and uh, there's a bug. Eat up, huh? So, um, do you like? A lot of women say they like French accents. That 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 that's well, sexy. Is that sexy. is it really sexy? Yes, it's totally sexy. His, everyone in that family, his mother's like way over sixty, and his father, but they're sexy. Just because of that language. No, but, I mean, I really thought about it, and I studied them, and I watched them, and when you speak French, well, when they do, anyway, they're pouting the whole time. They look, you know, oui, mais bah, bah, c'est le, le même chose pour moi, bah. you know, like always. There's always a cute just, little pout there. Didn't I look sexy when I was doing that? <laughs> <laughs> yes, you did. <laughs> Yes, you did. So even the old, like a 105-year-old man in France would be really sexy. Really sexy. Wow. And they're really expressive. I mean, they're really low-key. You know, they have, like, no inflection in their voice when they're speaking. Everything is okay and nothing bothers them at all. Blah, blah, blah. <laughs> but, but his mother, like, when something bad happens, it's uh -huh. hilarious. Like, she lost all of Michelle's baby pictures. He was mm -hmm. mortified. And she was like, oui, quelle horreur. It still cracks me up, I guess. <laughs> That's how they show great now. Great, I mean, quelle horreur. <laughs> now, where are you guys going to honeymoon? Do you, have you figured that no, all out? No, we don't get to do that. What are you talking about? Everyone well, gets a I'm, to, we're, I'm working. Oh, really? Yeah, I don't, we don't get to have a honeymoon. Oh. I know. That's so sad. Well, you get one, so don't, you'll be one of those couples no. that five years later you'll get one. No, never. <laughs> <laughs> 20 years, 30 years, you'll get to travel somewhere. One day, I guess, we'll go yeah. away. No, it doesn't matter. Every day for us is a honeymoon. <laughs> <laughs>
You couldn't yeah. even say that with a straight face. I couldn't. I, it, it had to be a Every day with us is a honeymoon. <laughs> He's watching right now, crying. He's like, oh. Now, well, let me ask you something. I've known you for a while, but uh, people might be interested now that you're such a, you know, you're, you're a big star now. What were you like as a kid? Because you, you seem like you're always on. Were you, were you that way when you were a kid? Yeah, I was uh, kind of a geek. I think because I, I loved acting and stuff when I was really little and in school. Somehow I decided I loved Fiddler on the Roof. Mm -hmm. And I like studied the album and every song and I decided the dream sequence is the cool part of the show. And I put together costumes and stuff, took it to school and declared to my teacher, I'm gonna perform this later on today. It was like, well, we were gonna do math, but Lisa's gonna do the dream sequence. <laughs> the and I just like ran around the room with all my stuff and like grandmother cycle, you know, a blessing on your head. Like, <laughs> I was so right. obnoxious. Right. And then I don't know how this happened. And they just wouldn't have schooling. They would say that we were gonna take a big test today to see who gets to go to high school, but we're not <laughs> having it. So you can do this little show? Yes. I don't know. <laughs> Somehow I got to go to like every classroom in the sixth grade and they're like, Oh, all right, everyone, attention. Um, Lisa Kudrow from Mrs. Thomas's class is here to do the dream sequence from Fiddler on the Roof. And I'm like ordering everyone around, all right, great, that's the album, put it in, no, not that song, the other one, all right, wait, I'm not ready. And just like, uh -huh. oh, oh. This is, stuff, this is stuff a guy couldn't get away with. <laughs> you know, if a guy said, I want to dress up and do a sequence from the Fiddler on the Roof and dance around, you know, they'd take care of him in the parking lot after school. <laughs> But all be dispatched. And that so, would be right. Well, uh, congratulations. <laughs> and good, too, yeah. Well, congratulations on everything. The Thank marriage, you. the shows. It's all going your way, kid, and you deserve it. Not good. <laughs> That's not wood. Oh, this right. is fiber foam. Yeah, I'm all right. <laughs> yeah, I'm ruined. For safety purposes, yeah. Friends is on Thursdays at 9.30 on NBC. Lisa Kudrow, come back again okay. soon. Yeah. There she is. Come right back with Jewel. We'll see you in a second.